Good morning, all. Good morning. You people should have patience, okay? My boss is traveling, but he's going to see you people before he leaves, okay? Tell him your problems quickly. He has no time for long stories. Hope you heard me clear. Yes, sir. All right. Juliet. Excuse me. Come, Moga. Come on, you left for that flower, you the killer. You know, you know, do what they employ you. Now, flower is secure. Eh? Come, madam, I said, hold your picking. Okay, no put hold your picking. I no put you out for my eye. I bet not me, not me for you from village. Enter your phone, they do get money. Come, come. You know, do a shower here. I, I look you like a shower for eye. I asked you to come and see me in my house. But you are stubborn. Do you think my boss have time for hustlers like you? I am not a hustler. I am an insurance broker. Please. That's why you cannot see me before seeing my boss. <laughs> I don't deal with PAs. I deal with bosses. Point of correction, I am not a PA, I'm an SA, Special Assistant, okay? <laughs> Whatever. Look, I chatted him up and he asked me to come here personally and see him. That is why I'm here. Okay. Then let's see how it goes. You can go and sit down. Smart. Boss? Yes. You have just three hours to check in time. <sighs> the pressure. Huh? The pressure of flying commercial. There is no alternative, sir. There would be an alternative very soon. A private jet. Wow! Private jet? I'm working on getting one. It has become imperative that I own one, given my very tight schedule. That would be very nice, sir. Thank you very much. So what's the update with the people waiting for me outside? I hear that I have a couple of people waiting to be attended. Yes, sir. I have instructed them to be brief with their issues. You said that to them? Yes, boss. I'm bad. <laughs> hey, Dahlia. Uh, you don't do things like that. As you journey on in life, you begin to understand these things. Hmm? When you're a philanthropist, it means that Chukwo Kikabiyama has blessed you. And the people would need you. And when they come for help, you try as much as you can to be nice. Huh? Yes, boss. Thanks. Huh? Uh, first and foremost, I'm not God, eh? So please. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. are all welcome. Yes, sir. I can see that you're all here based on uh, our last conversation. Yes, sir. And I made some promises. Yes, sir. Eh? <laughs> 
It is fine. Um, let me start by saying that I'll keep my promises. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Okay? Yes. I am sorry I took quite a while before coming out to attend to you. I have this impromptu trip that I have to make. It's quite important. However, I had you all in mind. Go to the office tomorrow. The accountant will be expecting all of you. Thank you, Thank sir. You, sir. Thank you, sir. you all be handed an envelope. I'll take care of your needs. Thank you, sir. Huh? Thank you, sir. Thank it is fine. Thank you, sir. It is fine. I'm um, smart. You man with quadruplets. Ah, what do you need, sir? How are you? I'm fine, sir. I remember you. You called me personally. You're the woman with the quadruplets. Yes, I remember you. How are the babies doing? They are fine, sir. Uh, I told you not to worry, eh? My children are gifts from God. Huh? It is fine. I made you some promises privately. I am going to keep those promises. I'll do what I have said and even more for the sake of the children. Huh? It is well. Uh, sir, do I know you, sir? Chief, uh, I am here on behalf of my son uh, that has been working in your company, but unfortunately, uh, he's in the police detention. Do I know your son? My son is uh, Bright or Sam. Mm. Uh, he works in your company and uh, he has been in police custody for the past one week now, sir. Oh, yeah, that's true. I remember him. So you're the father of a thief. Sir, please stand to your feet. Step down, please. Your son stole from me, sir. He stole my company's vehicle with goods in it. He felt that he would not be found out. Is it good? Huh? Chief, tamper justice with mercy. I even came with a goat to plead on his behalf. I do not need your goat, sir. I'm not hungry. We have enough to eat and drink here. Chief, please don't, 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 don't reject this offer. It is from the depth of my heart. Your son will have to face the law. He will be taken to court and if found guilty, he will go to jail for it. I try to do the best that I can do for my people. What I create in this town, a job opportunity, it's not an avenue for theft. Let the law run its course, sir. I believe that we are done here, sir. Please, step aside. Hmm. Father, can I help you? Sir, I don't have food for my family. I'm a widow and things has been so hard for me. My children are not going to school again because of money. Sir, please. In fact, we are starving. Please, sir, please help me. Please. It's okay. Please sit. Sit. We are starving, sir. Please help me. Madam, please. it's fine. Can you please sit down, please? Madam, are you in any way incapacitated? No, sir. Your hands are what? Yes, sir. As well as your legs? Yes, sir. So how is it that you do not have a job? Sir, my husband died and... Not an excuse, madam. My father died when I was pretty young. Yet my mom took it upon herself. Get up. Go out there to look for something to do so that my brother and I will be taken care of, madam. Thank you, sir. What you have done is not right. What you have just displayed is an act of laziness. Huh? Yes, sir. We'll have people roaming the streets. Able-bodied men and women roaming the streets. And instead of looking for something to do with their time and energy, they'd rather invest that energy in begging. It's not the right way to live. Yes, sir. How much really can I give you? But if you made more for yourself, you make enough for yourself. Huh? What I am going to do is that I'll have you go to town, find some little business that you can do uh, to keep body and soul together. Let me know how much it will cost. When I return, come back here and see me and I'll take care of it. Thank you, sir. Giving you fish today will not solve your problem. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh, Thank you. Sir. Beautiful lady, do I know you? 
Um, my name is Juliet. My friends call me Julie. You can call me that as well. I am here to... Stand up. I am from CCAC Brokers International. I'm here to discuss with you our latest insurance package. Wrong timing, young lady. I do not discuss business at home. This is a package that you would really like to Young keep. lady, I do not discuss official matters at home. I believe that we're done here. <laughs> All right, my people. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, so go to the office tomorrow. I want to go and check the results of the interview I attended last week. So you want to go check in? The results of interview. The... Yes. Today interview. Tomorrow result. Today interview tomorrow. Result. Yet nothing comes out of it. Something eh? will come out. Something good will come out of it. By the grace of the Almighty, something good will come out. Of it. I was just, eh? I was... So I'm not going to eat in this house today. Eh? Look at me. Mm -hmm. Do I look like your wife? No, look yeah. at my other eye. Do I, do I look do I, do I look like your mother? Peter, go ahead and insult me. Yes, no. go ahead and insult me. No, I was I was joking. You are joking. I know I'm not married. Reason is because I don't have money. But look at you. Nigga don't want ganya. All your mates are married. And you are here wasting your time with that jobless idiot. Is it not only a jobless man like you that, 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 that knows another jobless man like him? I don't, I don't blame you. I, I got him before no property. Be grateful, brother. Oh, be grateful. My, my Charlie Charlie, he, he will bounce back like a bouncing castle. I, I believe in him. I believe in him. You believe in a castle? Uh, That's not what I said. I, did. I said I believe. You, you Anyways, be, I want to go and you check. Believe, you believe in a goat, a jobless idiot. Like you. I want to go and check my results. No, your, no, your, no, your mama, your mama. No problem. Mother, Every day you keep checking your result and no, yet, yet nothing will come out of it. Mama? Mama? Oh. 
Who? It's me, Cha Cha. Oh, they're coming. <laughs> What's the segment? Guess, 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 guess. I can't guess. guess. Talk to me. Yes, no. No, I don't. I don't like guessing. <laughs> what is this? It's wonderful. Very wonderful. Bill, I'm so happy for you. I'm happy for me too. Stallion Group Company. Yes. The Stallion Group Company. Oh <laughs> my God. I know, right? I got an email from the Human Resource Department. And this, they sent me the letter. So I went to the cafeteria to print it out so that I can, you know, see this clearly. Okay. And boom, letter of acceptance as the account officer. Did you know I forgot my phone there? I was chatting it. I would have called you today. I was wow, coming. This is wonderful. <laughs> I know. And the take home is not bad at all. I know. Guess again. What? What? Guess, guess, I just guess. guess. What? Yes, no. Oh, tell me now. I can't guess. I got an alert. Okay. Of 20K. For just two weeks, the orientation program. For real? Not the actual job itself. Oh, this man is doing well. <laughs> Have you seen him in person? The chairman, right? Yes. No, no, no. They told me, they told us okay. that he went on a trip overseas. So when he's back, he'll see all his employees, you know, one by one, and, and then review us. But. Hey. I am so happy for you I'm once so again. I'm so happy for me. Let me just, let me just, let me just. Uh, uh, talk to me. Talk to me. Come See, on. See, I want, I want gist. I want to hear it. See, I want gist. I want gist. <laughs> <laughs> I want gist. Do you know how many candidates apply for this? How job? many? Like 50? 50. 200 to 250 candidates okay. applied for just five vacancies. Just five. You got it. I got it. <laughs> oh, baby. I'm so happy. I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for you. You know what? Wow! Thanks to that accounting software that I designed, that's what made me stand out, honestly. And it was just thanks to you. Thank you, baby, for pushing me. You're welcome. It's for us. It's for our made future. Me stand out. And I got this job. You've been there for me. You're like the best thing that's ever happened to me in this life. You're welcome. Thank you for for financing it. For buying me up when I was a <laughs> <laughs> For buying me well. Stop saying more. Oh, <laughs> I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you. <laughs> <laughs> Almighty Father. We are not some God. Thank you, Lord. Eh? You have looked upon my family with so much kindness, so much mm. love and blessing. Mm. Father, this news we are getting today, we have not had in a long, long time. Mm. Father, we thank you and glorify your name. Mm. Father, no one, eh? my daughter Rita, calm, calculating, money and your love, very obedient, Father. Mm. With so much energy. Eh? A daughter that anybody would be proud of. Father, I thank you for giving me such thank a daughter. Thank you, Lord. Thank and now you. you have blessed her with a good thank job. You. Father, I pray Amen. that in this her job, Amen. she will not see anything bad. Amen. 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 Nobody will try her. Nobody will tempt her. Nobody will do anything to her. But most especially, don't say I am greedy. Please, Father. Mm. Bless her with money. Amen. Let them pay her a million. Amen. Yes, now. Amen. So that we'll be able to take care of all our outstanding. Mm. Amen. God, you're awesome. My daughter hey. didn't have to wait too long to get this job. Thank you. Eh? I beg of thee. Eh? In the Thank mighty you. name of Jesus. Amen. 
Amen, amen, and amen. amen. I told you, and you are doing Shakara. See how you are disgracing the house. I'm sorry, Mr. Smart. It's not like I disregarded you. You see, there's a special reason that I want to see your boss. And that special reason is why I cannot see you first. What sort of reason is that? Am I not the one that will make a way for you? Look, I was told that your boss is not married, despite his wealth and affluence. So I was just getting ideas in my head, you know, if I get closer, I could make things work out. <clears throat> what is funny? Uh, you see, my boss, ladies from north, south, east, west, they fall on top themselves just to see my boss. Even top models, <laughs> movie, movie stars, music stars, all of them, they want to see my boss. My boss have gone around the whole world. He, he has seen beautiful ladies of all colors, all shapes, sizes. <laughs> and you think you are the one my boss is going to marry? <laughs> Look, it doesn't work like that. Let me tell you, people like your boss, they have issues choosing wives for themselves. I mean, I'm just going to help him and make things work out, you know. It's not about models and all of that shit. You are going to eat Juju? Or what? <laughs> it's not about Juju. Mr. Smart, take a good look at me. I mean, look closely at me. I'm a very beautiful and classy lady that knows how to win a man to herself, especially men of timber and caliber, like your boss. So it's not about Juju. Just fix a meeting between both of us. That's all. That's all you need to do. Juliet. <laughs> you really have got. Anyway, I'll fix an appointment with you and my boss when he comes back from the street, okay? When is he returning? That's all I need to know. That's yes, all, smart. Girl, you're pushing your luck so far. Sorry. Sorry. Just, just fix the meeting. That's all. That's how smart. That's how smart. Just fix the meeting. Um, Rita, I need 5k and I need to put my KK in order. Look at me. No, no, look at me very well. Do I look like Central Bank of Nigeria? Every minute, urgent 5k, urgent 5k, urgent 5k. What is it now? Yes, I'm talking to you. What is it? Today yeah. is my first day. Please, allow me. Today is my first day at... That this new job that I just Are you going to give me the 5k or not? Stop stop talking all this rubbish. Yeah. Shabi, yesterday mama gave you 3k from her little crayfish business. And you you, you put it inside this keke business. Just say you don't have it. Just say you don't have it. You, you, you're telling me telling me your, your life history. Just tell me you don't have it. Please don't shout at me. I will shout at you. I did not shout at you. Please don't shout at me. Let's respect ourselves in this house. When you are going for this interview, I used to give you transport. That keke, is, is it a snake? As if he's swallowing money every every two two seconds. Excuse me, let me keep my nerve. Muki na kwaka. Akwarangaka. Mwai ulanga, mwai ye. Odkisiad, odkisiad. Try it now. Try it, I'll call mama for you. I did not touch you. Don't touch me. All you said you will tell me whether that keke is snake that is swallowing money. You will tell me. All this money you have been going for, you have been going for interview here and there. I've not been giving you transport fare. When we are looking for this job, I used to I used to give you transport fare. I used to give you transport fare. Don't 
Just ordinary 5k, you know, you can you cannot give to your only brother. What's the update? We recruited three more account officers and two engineers. They are done with the orientation program. I see. How are they doing? They are doing great, though it's too early to judge. That's for you. Ten minutes. With an individual is enough for you to ascertain if they fit into your company. Ah. Oh, correct, sir. I would like to see them, especially the accountant. I'd like to see them, get them to come to my office, one after the other. Okay, sir. I'll do that at once. It's not. Awesome. Good day, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you, Thank you, sir. How are you today? I'm fine, sir. I have your CV in my hands. It looks good. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank uh, you. Uh, I'd like to know how long you intend to be with us. Um, sir, for a long time, for a long time. That is not an answer. Well, sir, five years, five years, because I intend to travel abroad for further studies. Yes. I see. So what if the company decides to send you abroad for training and you return, you head your department? That would be great, sir. Oh my God. This is the kind of opportunity I've been looking for. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. It is fine. Keep doing a good job. We're going to revisit this topic in five or six months. It's okay, sir. I'd like to see how you're faring here first. Thank you, sir. Oh, thank, you. Oh, thank you, sir. Yes! Thank you, sir. Is this your first job? 
situation. Yes, sir. What's your name? Rita. Miss Rita Wanko, I see that you attended the uh, University of Nigeria. So. Yes, sir. Are you enjoying your job here? Yes. Uh, Miss Rita Wonko. I'll ask that you pen down your resignation. I have looked through your CV and I can tell you that this job is not for you. You were clearly hired in error because all out of town. But I'll be nice enough to ask that you pen down your resignation so that I don't have to fire you. So? I should sign my own resignation letter with my own hand. Sir? Sir, please. If I don't really talk to the company standard or or anything, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. Like you said, I graduated from UNN, sir. So I'm, I'm intelligent. I'm, I'm, I'm smart. I'm, I'm okay, sir. Please, I'm very sorry, sir. Please forgive me. Please, if I've if I've offended you in any way or how I might have behaved or anything that might I might have done, I'm sorry, sir. Please, please. My father is dead, and my mother she's she sells crayfish in the streets. My brother does cake business as well. I'm the breadwinner of the family. I'm the one that provides the bread in the family. So please, please, sir. I'm intelligent. I can meet up to your company standard, whatever it is that you need. See if I've done anything that you don't like, I'm so Yes, we talk. This is all about intelligence. This is about you being a square peg in a round hole. This child. Is not for you. You're wasting my time. If you do not do what I've asked you to do, you leave me without other choice but to fire you. And of course, you know what the consequences would be. I've been nice enough by asking you to pay your resignation. Do it now. Your brother is not working. It's my own. God will still bless you. Right. Oh, we go through pains, 
Though we go through trials and so many hurdles. So he then said I should sign the resignation letter and that's how I, I that's how I I, lo I I lost my job. He asked you to sign the resignation letter. Momori Femme, you didn't do anything. He just asked you to sign resignation letter. That's what I explained to you. I, I, I didn't I didn't do anything. Rita, you must have done something. No sane human being would just come to the office and ask a newly em employed person to sign a, a resignation okay, Mama, letter when she hasn't done anything. Let me just give you the details. Give me the details. So he started by asking me if I like the office if i like working here and then i looked at him for a bit as i was looking at Chalo. him and then i now tell you looked at him for a bit how much but a bit you looked at him how i look i look i i looked at him so that like so that the answer will come <laughs> and then i now answered him that okay I Rita, like... you looked at him in a very bad manner. And out of anger, he told you to sign your resignation. That is exactly what Mama, I, I just looked No, at... no, 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 Rita. I... I'm a mudani nenem. I know how you look at me when I'm angry or mad at you. Like, like you're looking at me now. It's not what I would have It doesn't matter your mate. Yes? You just look at me, see, like... That's what you must have done, made the man. Said, sign your resignation. Where, where, where do you think you're going? If you see what I'm talking about, someone is talking to your mother, not just someone you want to walk uh, walk out on her. My friend, will you get out of here? Stop looking at me in that manner. Get her, get her before when you can pull on After buying a drink, I show for you for you to go for that interview. Where you don't know? If you ever know, I'm not a maid. Break it when you don't even have money to repay it. I'll ask that you pen down your resignation. I have looked through your CV and I can tell you that this job is not for you. You were clearly hired in error because I was out of town. But I'll be nice enough to ask that you pay down your resignation so that I don't have to fire you. even look at me. Eh? What did I do to that man? That's how he does to most ladies. He doesn't have their time. So are you saying there's nothing that can be done? Something can be done. Really? Yes. You and I can continue from where we stopped. Since your target has failed. You and I will not continue anything. Because we did not stop anywhere now. We did not. I want the boss. Juliet, why are you rejecting me like this? Look at me. I'm a big boy on my own. Never mind that I'm working for my boss. Yeah. You see, in this life, we all have dreams and aspirations. Hmm? So let's not even go there. Oga oh boss, please. Oh, you should have just told me that this was going to be a very fruitless and meaningless meeting. You should have told me. Eh? As it is right now, I'm very, very angry. 
I'm angry. Look, I want the boss. The real boss. Oga boss, not baby boss. Oh, I want the boss. Please. Charlie, Charlie, one day. Charlie, my man. What's up now? Now, ah, what did happen? My brother, do you know the you know for money you go yo yo? You didn't go to work today. My brother, not go work today. Why? Okay, okay. That's problem. You know this our work must for my work. You go work for police, work for that, work for mm -hmm. you know a lot of people. Even the owner of the cake says that that troublesome man. Brother, it's understand. okay. It's okay. We only pray that this country gets better someday. Huh? Just take it easy. <laughs> okay? So, um, your sister, go, is she in? My sister. Yeah. No, no, she, uh, she went out with my mother in the market. Okay. Yes. Okay. Just, just take it easy, okay? Just stop complaining too much. Everywhere is like that. Things are hard, okay? But I believe that it's going to get better someday. Okay, uh, there's this new place I'm trying to get her a new job. It's it's a new company. Mm. Yes, uh, yeah. Hold on. Help me. Give her this paper. It's the address of the new company. They are recruiting people now. You are trying for my sister. <laughs> <laughs> you are trying. Okay, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Thank you. Zeke. Please try and deliver this message to her. All right. It's when very she, important. When she comes, I will tell, I will tell her you came. Okay. And maybe back. Well, let me be going. Eh? Just try and deliver the message. Well, okay. Well. Take care, man. Take care. Correct, man. Do that for me, okay? I will. Strikes black. That's me. I'm happy to see you, Ikenga. The stallion himself. I forgot no. The only man that God created very early on Monday morning. Monday morning. When all the ingredients, the substance are complete. Zule. And overflowing. If <laughs> 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 I'm happy to see you. Hi. Please sit down. I'm excited to see you. That's good. Ah, God, I'm going. Ah, how did you know that I was in town? Mm. <laughs> yeah, that reminds me of to be trotting around the globe again. If I'm mad again, Baba Lumba. A man has to work hard. And you know the kind of business we do. For you to remain successful and I dare to say be ahead of your competition, you have to keep soldiering on. Uh, so, yes, I traveled. I went to Malaysia and I passed through Hong Kong and Taipei. You know, I have this new production line. So, I went to scout for machinery for it. So that took me out of town. Huh? I see. That's the way. <laughs> Thank you. And that's the way you create me. Thank you. Thank you. We have to keep working hard. <laughs> they will not understand. They don't get it. Yeah. The only way to get ahead in life is hard work. I'm telling you. Hard work. You won't burn it. <laughs> and one day, one bloody gelatin, <laughs> one brief rap, one nick and poop from nowhere, we just zoom out. I would like to be like a queen in But it's not possible. I will see if we make tickets. They don't. Is it possible? What am I doing? Not possible. Don't go abroad again. Then. I got the cut soap for me. I got cut soap for me. Even if we see these boys now. Nah. Okay, Lily. Okay, Lily. But it is fine. Ikenga. Yeah, but that reminds me. That reminds me. Yeah. They don't. They stand on himself. I'm only fine, man. Is it five months? Okay. Uh, you need to color your finger. 
I want to see a wedding ring. He can't give you a He can't give you a But it is fine, King. I have um, good news. And that is? I have found a ring. You have what? <laughs> no idea. He ain't got nobody. He got away with very soon. <laughs> Odobu! Okay, Mbuto. Odobu! Nalo. Nalo. How you working, you are you? Are you for real? I'm serious. You see? It's boom one, no, I'm a little chum one. Eh? Okay, remember what we discussed. What did we discuss again? Okay, I want you to do exactly like a good thing. A good thing, dear If you must marry. Yes. Remember, you must go to your lineage. A typical African woman. Yes. Bicep with difficult. Around them, with all the paraphernalia here. You think you're talking from experience? You're talking from experience. I like her and But I have heard you. Uh, she's from she's from our place. Uh, a well-rounded African woman. I'm afraid I like <laughs> She's an African woman. Eh? But let me surprise you. If on water. If on water. You get where? Well, well, I, I don't expect less from you. You get where? Eh? Don't expect I don't want to talk. I don't expect. I don't want to talk. I don't want to I don't die on one with pigs, man. If on I will make you go all over the day. Because you're here. Look at this. Eh? Big man, how are you? Uh, I am fine. You must be a citadel man. Am I right? Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm a citadel. Ah, it's fine. Eh? Rest easy. <laughs> uh, is your mother here? Is she at home? My mother? Yes. yes. She's in. May I come in and see her? Okay. After you. Uh, um, so, so please sit. Let me get my mother. Ah, thank you. Yes. Thank you. Mama. Mm -hmm. Ah. <laughs> it is well. Hey, yeah, Mom. I have come to see you, Mama. To see me? My name is Chief Dr. Don. Odunze. Chairman, Stallion Group of Companies. <laughs> Mama. Hey? Chief Odunze. Mama. The one we hear and watch on TV. In the flesh. Hey. <laughs> Chief, give me your style of. I did, did, did my daughter do something wrong? You know, she came and told me that you asked her to resign. Yes. But I, I, I know she was lying. I, I knew there was something she wasn't telling me. Oh, we can call me. Be couple long way for me. Just, just uh, forgive us, please. Uh, Mama, hmm? relax. Sit down. <laughs> just, just sit down. Hey. <laughs> Uh, Mama, <coughs> yeah, well. oh, the ma. Oh, the ma. <laughs> you look well. Thank you. <laughs> Mama, this is a courtesy visit. Please, whatever my daughter did, please forgive her. She's just a child, Mama. <laughs> Mama, <laughs> uh, as a businessman, I get to travel very often. Uh, I have been abroad for a couple of weeks, uh, but I promised myself that on my return, I would come to visit you and also get an opportunity to see you return. 
who used to work in my company as one of my staff. Yes. <laughs> oh, she didn't do anything bad. Please. <laughs> I'm on the contrary now. I, I think that your daughter working with me was the Lord's doing. Oh yes, it gave me a chance to get to know her better. As a matter of fact, I played a few pranks on her, thinking that it was going to throw her off balance, but she held on. <laughs> she held on and um, showed me that she comes from home. And that is why I'm here today, Mama. And I want to say a very big congratulations. Thank you. You know, it's God that put her in my room. I want to tell you what. But why are you congratulating me? I am congratulating you, Mama, for you have given birth to the woman that has captured my heart enough to become my wife. <laughs> Mama, I have traveled the world and I have seen all kinds of women. None caught my attention enough to want to settle down and start a family until I met Rita, your daughter. Rita Kenny. Rita Kenny, Mama. Rita <laughs> Kenny. Mama, I must say that your daughter is a special read in a time where the world is struggling with morals and values I meet a very beautiful woman who's not just got fearing but respectful humble and very very disciplined Mama. if you allow her be my wife I can assure you that we will be special together for she's going to make a wonderful wife and a good mother to our children. And that is why I am here. And that's why I'm congratulating you. Eh? Thank you. <laughs> You will have girls, intelligent. <laughs> when I read that pretty, you know, them alone. Yes. Uh, oh, yes. Yes, thank you. Drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it, drop it. Bring it down, bring it down. Drop it, drop it. Yes, sir. Thank you. Mama. All this for you. Yeah? All of them. All of them for me? For you, Mama. He said, You don't want to leave me. Let me help you. You don't like me.
She is shocked, Mama. I know. Uh, uh, I didn't tell her that I would be here. Uh, I'm sorry I didn't tell you. I wanted to surprise you, Rita. Uh, your mom is such a pleasant, pleasant host. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, so what, what do we offer you to eat? Ah, uh, Mama. Uh, not today. Uh, Mama. Uh, when uh, next time I'll visit you? I promise I would let you know. Uh, I'll also let her know uh, so that um, she can prepare me. You know, uh, our native soup. Yeah. <laughs> She's a very good cook. I can tell, Mama. Notwithstanding, we must get you something. Maybe I'm going to get him a, a fofa or something. <laughs> uh. That's it, Welcome, sir. Why are you so excited? What do you mean? Why, why am I shut so excited? Up. Mama, what? Mama, will you shut up? Have you seen any blind man at Apunya Sugar? No, no, and he, he throws it out. What are you talking about? What do you mean? What am I talking about? You told me that he forced you to resign. Oh, Chief Odun Zeki Nekumake, the man that everyone knows about. We hear about him, we watch him on TV. Mama, you, don't, you don't know what he's capable of. I know the you man. Know. Handsome, one of the richest men in this city. Eh? Handsome, look at how handsome he is. I don't know what he did to me. I don't know what he's capable of doing. What did he do to you? You're shouting. Mm. Don't tell me I'm shouting when I'm not shouting. I don't shouting. want any part of this. I don't know why you're being so naive. I'm washing my hands off this part. Pilate, I can't get there. You're not washing your hands of anything. You're part of it. He has told me what he wants. He wants to marry you. And he told me he was playing a prank on you. That's why he told you to resign. So now you listen and listen good. We accept this man. We're going to go in there. You will act like a happy girl, you will smile, and I'll act like a happy mother, and we'll both smile and go in there. Mother! Are you threatening me? Cherry. I am not the dawn that you used to know. I can be very deadly if push comes to shove. Don't dare me. I could kill you here. And even your cops will be arrested. Let this be the last time I see you. Unless, of course, you want to find yourself dead. <laughs> 